everyone, I'm Charlotte, and today I'm going to show you some of MIT's amazing science facilities. With nine different fields to study, you are bound to find a field that suits you. And if you're not quite sure what you want to study with MIT, we offer specialized and flexible science courses to help you discover what you are passionate about. Now let's start our tour with the Center of Nanoscale Biophotonics, or CNB for short. Here we are in our impressive Center for Nanoscale Biophotonics, where quantum physics meet biology and chemistry. But let's meet our RMIT science student, Daniel, who can explain that as further. The team here at RMIT uses the power of light to look into the body and see how cells behave with one another. We do that using interesting and important lasers. What we have here is an optical benchtop microscope, which is one of a handful in the world. This allows us to image deeper into the cells and look into the body. This is one of the world-class research facilities we have here at RMIT University. Yeah, it looks amazing. Thank you so much, Daniel, for showing us. Now let's move on to our world-class chemistry labs. Our chemistry students have access to advanced instruments to analyze samples and to learn more about the properties of materials. Jonathan here can tell us more about the space. Yeah, so in this lab, uh, second and third year organic uh, chemistry students will look at replicating experiments that are used in industrial processes for green technologies, as well as looking at the properties of water to uh, look at its purity. We're now here at RMIT's World Experiences Lab, where students get to see chemistry and nanotechnology in action using augmented reality. Patrick, please explain us what's going on. Well, the high-resolution screens behind us allow us to visualise molecules and nanomaterials in 3D. We've actually got Kevin over here building a molecule at the moment in augmented reality. That is so cool. Can I have a try? Sure thing. Let's give it a go. Let's head to our Modua campus to show you more of our amazing science facilities. Now we are in our Food Innovation and Research Centre. Our future food technologists develop nutritious, safe, and innovative food for consumers and learn how to comply to the strict industry safety and health regulations. Billy, tell me, is that what is smelling so delicious here? Yes, yeah, so we made some products today. So we made um, a bread and also two types of cakes, one with butter and also one with margarine. Besides this commercial that we've got here, we've also got the pilot plant and also um, a research lab. And also we've got a sensory lab where we look at the sensory profile of our products. Um, speaking of the sensory lab, we're gonna take these products in there and we're gonna taste them. Amazing, can't wait. Now we arrive at our state-of-the-art bioscience teaching lab. Shaleen, show me on the screen, what is that funky thing? I'm so pleased you asked. What we're looking at are plant cells under a fluorescent microscope. Here in the biosciences teaching lab, we teach a range of sciences, from botany through to cell biology, clinical microbiology, and animal physiology and ecology. Here in these labs, this is where we teach our students how to do real-world experiments and we give them the skills they need to explore cells and life. Amazing, sounds really cool. Thank you for showing us. Here we are at one of my favourite spots at RMIT, the Robotic Optical Observatory Telescope, which was actually set up with two US universities. Have a look inside. The 16-inch telescope here can track asteroids, satellites and other objects and measure their movements. Predicting and understanding the movement of objects in orbit Earth is really important as it can prevent future collisions. I hope you all enjoyed this tour of our beautiful science spaces here at MIT. And remember, if you have any other questions, feel free to reach out to our super friendly staff at Studied at MIT. We hope to see you soon. Bye-bye.